Honen was the founder of the first independent branch of Japanese Pure Land Buddhism. Religious reformer who didn't find enlightening in the official Buddhism, found a different approach to Buddhism that was accessible to everybody, adopted it, and spread it in Japan. Honen was born in 1133 in a prominent family. His father was a city official, killed in 1141 by another city official, sent there by the emperor to govern in their province. While dying, Honen's father swore him not to hate the enemy and to become a monk. Fulfilling his father's wishes, he went to his uncle's monastery, where he studied at the Tendai Temple on Mount Kie and became a priest. During his time on Mount Kie, Honen was focused on finding a way to bring salvation to all through Buddhism, but he was not happy with what he found on the mount. At 24, he moved to different places to research more, but still unsatisfied, returned to Mount Kie and studied further. He ran into the commentaries written by the Chinese pure land master Shan Dao. This commentary persuaded Honen that Nyanfo, a Nembutsu in Japanese, was all we need to enter Amitabha's pure land. Before, Nyanfo was used alongside other new practices, but Shan Dao was the first to say that only Ninfao is necessary. This new discovery made Honen finally leave Mount Kie and Tendai tradition. He moved to Kyoto, where he gathered followers from different social statuses, normally not allowed into Buddhist practice. Honen became an important figure in Kyoto, and even priests and people from the higher class, even an imperial region, were coming to him for spiritual advice. His fame attracted criticism too, mostly from noted contemporaries who practiced traditional Buddhism. They criticized him for his sole reliance on Nembutsu, his followers for vandalism and temples. All this led to Honen's exile from Kyoto in 1207. That didn't stop the movement in Kyoto and Honen continued to spread his teachings while in exile. In 1211, the ban was lifted and he was allowed to return. But soon after returning, he died in 1212. Honen's main work, Senchakushu, was written in 1198, but published by his wish only after his death. The other work is his last testament, one sheet document. Most of his teaching was written down by his students and later historians. Thank you for watching. Don't hesitate to comment below and share this video with your friends. See you in my next video.